Magic of Math here, and today we're going to answer a standardized math test question where we need to distribute in order to compare some expressions. So here we go. Here's our question. Which of the following is equivalent to this expression? 3 multiplied by the expression or quantity x minus 1. And you have four answer choices to pick from. I'm going to ask you to pause your video now, answer the question to the best of your ability, and come back and hit play, and we'll review your work together. Welcome back. So we have our product here, 3 multiplied by this pro, uh, parentheses quantity x minus 1. We're going to use the distributive property to clear our parentheses and write this in simplest form. So we're going to take 3 and multiply it to the first term. So 3 times x has a product of 3x. Now we're going to take 3 and multiply it to the second term, which is negative 1. 3 multiplied by negative 1 has a product of negative 3, and in simplest form, this expression is 3x subtract 3. We can see that that is answer C. But before we leave our time together, I want to make sure we review choices A, B, and D and make sure that those are incorrect and make sure that we didn't make a mathematical error. So let's look at choice A. Choice A has the variable x and then it has three like terms. These three terms are all constants and we can combine them to write this in simplest form. So we have x, and then we have 3 plus 3 is 6, and negative 1 is 5. x plus 5 is not equivalent to this expression, so that was correct. This is an incorrect choice and not our correct answer. Choice B. We have our x term, and then we have two like terms, 3 and negative 1. So we have our x, 3 and negative 1 are positive 2, and x plus 2 is not equivalent to the expression we have. Then we have choice D. 3x subtract 1 is in simplest form, and we can see that the constant term in this expression, negative 1, does not match r negative 3, and this is not an equivalent expression, and we were right all along. It is indeed answer choice C, 3x subtract 3. So thank you for joining me today to answer this math test question about distributing to compare expressions. That's the magic of math, where we continue to master math one video at a time. Thanks for joining me today. I hope you'll come back soon and have a great day.